What's up YouTubers? TMD back in the building. We've got the driver today, Yukari san. Say hello to the the people. We're in the back of the <laughs> car with the kids. Yee! It's Halloween today guys. Yukari doesn't need a costume. She's scary enough. <laughs> Right, so we are heading, guys, to my uh, favorite bakery, which is called uh, Saffron. And uh, this is uh, a bakery that's only, is it only in Chiba, you carry? Oh, man. Spread one. Yeah, so this bakery is probably the best, one of one of the best, probably in uh, Chibaken, Japan, and they do a nice selection of uh, pastry and breads, and it's uh, very busy. We're going to the. Are we off to the local shop or the big one? Big one. Oh, we off to the big one, you guys. Yeah. <coughs> so there's not much to report, guys, really. Um, what's up, Zen? So today I think we're going to get some. Uh, Where? There's a gauge in there. Gaijin stand, look. Oh, yeah, I saw, yeah. All the kids are at school. Let's um let's let's interview you, Cuddy then. Just try to think of some questions to ask the wife. him in the building uh, as you can see in the background is Mount Fuji pretty amazing uh, I'm so happy today it's the first time I've seen Fuji sand this year uh, no is it I think I might have seen it in February kids are here may look Fuji Fuji 
Fujisan, Achia. So we're outside. Uh, we're outside Saffron today. It's quite a big bakery. It's on. Uh, they have their own um, on-site bakery over here. And as as you know, Saffron is the uh, specialized uh, spice thing. Yeah. If you if you ever uh, come into Chiba, check this out. It's it's the best bakery, I think. Um, one of the best in Japan. Although their pizzas are not that good, I don't really like the pizzas out here. <clears throat> but they have a a double a double floor where you can um, eat in. But obviously with the uh, ten percent tax. See, it's quite user friendly. You can uh, do some uh, Instagram links. Oh wow, they've changed it. They've blocked off the uh, other side. They do cakes in there. So I presume they've got some um, Halloween specials. There's some eggplant and cheese. Sweet corn with uh, hot dog. It's a really nice place. Nice smell in here. Is there no idea? Um, they do some like teriyaki style hamburgers with pepper. Apple cinnamon. That could be um, sweet corn. Oh wow, look at that one. Did you want to get Halloween, man? Looks like they've got some uh, French bread with brown sugar, almond. Oh, these are these are all new menus that they've got over here. They also do a, a nice selection of sandwiches. We've got katsu, egg mayonnaise, baguette rolls, salad. They also do some. Uh, some nice uh, karage here. These are like black bunned burgers. Hello. We've got some um, sliced ham with red onion. Roast beef. Oh, roast beef. Sorry, arigato. But the best thing about saffron is are uh, these. This is uh, mango or passion fruit. I think that that's a passion fruit. It's uh, Chinese yogurt. <laughs> Going over here. We've got some uh, delicious, um, I think they're apple pies. Yeah, they because we come here early in the morning, they've got um, all the stuff out. Because you have to get here really early. Uh, in Japan, very famous, they do a... Uh, it's called curry pan. This one's got egg with beef. And this is one of my favorite things, is the, the chicken karage. These things are uh, cheese rolls, they look like uh, the alien pods. Sausage rolls. Oh, they've got the uh, mustard ones in. Awesome. One of my favorite things here is the um, pesto and cheese slices. I 
as you can see they've got some saffron there Oh, what? Japanese pizza. The only thing um, that I would probably uh, complain about is I wish that they would do just regular pizzas. <coughs> of service. Egg and ham roll. This is a good one. This is the uh, pork chashu with leeks. And they have some organic food as well. We've got some caramel. Uh, they, they've got lots of stuff today, you carry. They've got some uh, organic apples, leeks. We've got some. Oh, this is pretty cool. Zen Astro Boy, Thomas the Tank Engine rolls Astro Boy. got some uh, I don't know what that is just like French bread with icing sugar they also do um, a nice selection of drinks as well yeah it's like I said it, it is uh, really good got a nice selection of breads fresh bread it's out of the oven They've got some uh, organic jams. Oh, I don't know if that's like some kind of olive oil or something. Walnut oil, honey jams. It's like a miso paste, like a miso instant. You know? And uh, look at that, I forgot. There's some uh, big like German style bread there. So yeah, it's uh
Dzięki. Dzięki, kite. Oj. Hey, what's up guys? TMD uh, Saffron Food Review in the building! <laughs> Woo! God damn man, it's a beautiful day in Japan, Saturday. No work today. I'm not in my regular school. I don't know what to try first, so... Basically, what do we have here? We have... I'm going to try this one first. This is the... Um, one of my favorite uh, items from Saffron is, uh, I don't know, what's that? It's about 60, I'd say about 60 centimeters. And in Japan, these, uh, they're really mad on these like uh, German sausages. What's up there? It's not curry pan zen. This is um, mustard, French mustard with, um, it's like a sausage roll. If you're from England, you're watching, um, sausage rolls are quite popular. This is kind of a posh one. But as you can see inside there, it's got like a, a, a smithering of uh, French Dijon mustard. Ah, très bien, monsieur, très bien. So I'm going to snap a bit off. Me and you can normally share this. Bread, as you can see, it's got some crispiness to it. That's the sausage meat in there. Um, let's dive in. Hmm. The bread is almost like a, it's like a baguette almost. It has just the right amount of Dijon mustard in there. The sausage is okay. 
Yukari, why are these sausages so popular in Japan? Japanese sausage. Why? It delicious. Mm. One of my favorite foods in Japan is this. And the next one I'm going to dive into. This is um, like a soft, in Japanese, puchi puchi. Again, we've got that. Um, we've got that sausage, but this sausage seems to be a little bit more peppery. It's like a pepper sausage, and um, it's in a roll that's been wrapped with uh, cheese, melted cheese on top. Get <laughs> you, Gary. I'm doing my food reviews, man. So, I don't know what this one's called, UK, but let's dive in. Now, I do have the application for um, the app for Saffron, so sometimes you get discounts, but you can see it's kind of like a, a filo. Pastry, that's actually quite nice. The cheese gives, the cheese gives, gives it some texture. Mm. I love melted cheese. The sausage, on point. The uh, pastry, soft. It's a little bit greasy though. That's my only complaint. But now, the sausage. If you're from England and you've tried, um, it's called uh, pepperami. It's like a German sausage snack, pork. As you can see in this one, it's got um, black pepper in there. Delicious. Um, very good. I'm going to go in for another bite. UK is going to get half of this. So you see that? Look how, look how soft that is. Look at that. It's got a lot of elastic. Mm. So it's Halloween today. I'm going to do some Halloween stuff today, probably. Now, the creme de la creme. This is Japanese fried chicken. Um, it's probably one of my favorite places to buy uh, this chicken. It's karage. It's got a very crispy outer coating. I think this has the skin on it. Yep, it does. Has the skin on the outside. Japanese karage is one of the best fried chickens you can get in the world. Fact, way better than KFC. So let me just pull that off. Get a little nibble of the end. Mm. So good. The crunch. Chicken is moist, not dry. It's like a breast of chicken. That's been coated in uh, special Japanese flavorings. Mm. I could eat this all day long. The calories are a bit higher. Yeah. You try. I'm sorry. Yeah, you want some chicken? Sorry. Karage. Mm. This is actually cold, but you could heat it up. <clears throat> Chicken's top quality meat. Just amazing. Beautiful consistency on that um, coating of the chicken. A lot better than the, uh, the like convenience store fried chicken. That's real chicken. The stuff in convenience kind of like processed. I'm not a big fan of it. People only eat when when it when they're drunk. Now, the next uh, review, and you can see, look at all that saffron. People are amazed that, like in Japan, saffron they like really use a lot of it. As you know, saffron's quite expensive. Now this one, I don't know what this is called, but it's it looks like a bolognese meat sauce with obviously saffron in it. It's on this like really crispy doughy bread with melted cheese. Mmm. 
I love melted cheese when it's gone hard and crispy. I don't know if you guys can see that. Um, it's really soft as you can see. Let's go in for a bite. It's like quite flaky the dough. Mmm. Mmm. Yeah, it's got like a, a pasta base on there. I don't know if that's meat or not. Oh. It's bolognese. <laughs> that's a good word. Really soft and gooey. Awesome. Mm. The sauce has a lot of richness to it. Almost tastes like um I can taste a lot of tomato puree in there. The melted cheese is a nice combination. I think that could be a pork. Mm. It was quite cheap as well. I think it was like 180 yen. But yeah, that bread. Papa, tabate? Okay. Oh, they won't sit back. Yeah, as you can see here, thick dough, the sauce and the cheese is all melted. It's crispy on top. Yeah, it's like a pizza bread almost, but that bread's really good, really soft. The dough that they use at um, Saffron, I think it's really um, soft and doughy. So Japanese people like it. The next one is one of my personal favorites. It's um, chashu, which is uh, pork that's been um, cooked for a long, long time with Japanese negi or leeks on um, like a, a chapata bread. And it's got a dousing of mayonnaise on there. But I normally just buy this because I love I love chashu. It's so good. Let's split that in half. There you go, guys. I'm going in. No, no, no. Chashu is so flavorful. The addition of the um, negi gives it a more of a, a fresh taste to it. This bread is crispy on the bottom, really doughy. Really good. Really good. And you get quite a lot. Mm. Also has the addition of like uh, black pepper. Definitely one of my favorite items. If you ever come to Japan and visit me, I'll take you to the, this shop. Everything's premium there, man. Staff are super friendly today. Like I said, we saw Mount Fuji today. So you can actually sit upstairs, but I think because of COVID, they've stopped the um, second floor, right, you guy? Maybe. But yeah, it's a definitely um, one of the best bakeries that I've ever been to in Japan. So I'm gonna have a little nibble at this. Today's gonna be really busy. I've got a few YouTube videos to make. And um, keep tuned, guys. And thanks for watching my channel. This is TMD, Saffron Bakery, Chiba, Japan. 10 out of 10 for all of this food. Nice to wash it down with a nice cup of hot coffee. Ah, TMD out.